Finally here, the house where people have been waiting for. It's gonna be very cool. Finally good weather. Uh, here we got two doggies waiting to be on camera. We're first gonna go over garage because I don't have a car. So we remade a garage into uh, a home gym. It's very cool. Uh, I was just hitting the gym before doing this, of course. I was doing some bench. Uh, we were doing, uh, this might look like a small amount of weights, but this is actually a hyper-densed raw titanium, these things. They weigh about 100 kilos. Awesome. So this was just a warm-up dose. It's like 220 kilos or something like that. Uh, other than that, uh, this gym contains most things you need. The roof is kind of short, so you can't do uh, pull-ups and whatnot, but that's, that's about it. And... Uh, yeah, we also got a beautiful picture of Billy here. When we lose motivation, we just look at him and we get inspired. <laughs> By this perfect species, species, specimen, specimen. And uh, yeah, there we go. There's a garage and since I don't have a car, Generally don't move around a lot, but when I do, we have an electric bike, of course, because it's very cool, they're very powerful. <laughs> <laughs> These things, uh, I think the max speed of it is like 100 kilometers per second. And it's got a, uh, the gears is Shimano Alivio 27 speed gears, uh, 3x9, of course, and the tires are um, pretty advanced as well. It's the Kenda K1047. You know, it's pretty high-end stuff. The display is OLED and stuff like that. Uh, it doesn't get better than this. It's uh, The range is also like, you can go anywhere. Uh, something like 10,000 kilometers, I believe. I don't remember exactly, it's a good battery. And of course we got a trampoline or whatever it's called, because we're still a kid. So that is the outside. Uh, we also got number one dog here, who's guarding. Very lethal species. His name is Tiberius and he's a basset hound. And he's a very good boy. And we also got another guy lying here. He's kind of hot today. And Caesar with his fat fur. He doesn't want to be outside. Both of them are six years old. And uh, he's a Xiao Xiao. And uh, here's the living room, pretty empty. I'm not very good at decorating. I kind of like the table right now. And uh, I kind of removed it. We're gonna, like, I'm gonna have to replace it soon, but that's gonna happen uh, soon enough. And we also got a pretty big TV here because the room is big and uh, require a, uh, a sizable TV for that. And the roof is super tall and whatnot. So it's kind of very open, which is uh, one of the best part about the house. It's a very open house. It's only one floor though. And uh, very cool, don't you think that? He doesn't care. The kitchen, we've got a pretty standard kitchen. Uh, we got a big ass Mirana here, one of the best purchases I made, I believe. It's very big and uh, it costs like $600. However, it came with uh, one of those Mirana mounts that's worth, at the time, $600 a year or something like that. And now it's, I think it's seven, 900 euros or something like that. So basically this thing was free. And it's, uh, you know, it's pretty large. I, I do like it. And shag bark here. Got some Star Wars stuff. Um, other than that, I'm sure people want to know what's in the, the fridge, of course. So we got uh, a lot of Monster, of course. Uh, monster do provide with a lot of, a lot of it all the time. But uh, my family used to come by and steal, so I don't have infinite amounts of amount and I usually drink myself like three or four tea a day or something like that so it kind of goes out pretty quick and uh, yeah we also have some soy milk I'm sure people want to comment about that very cool and uh, what else we got we've got a very rare here 
It's a very unique monster. Monster Sandis, these are uh, rare years. This is from, uh, I believe this is from year 1927. Great year for monster. It's a very unique taste. And another great year for monster, I believe it's uh, this one. This is from 1981. Great flavor, great flavor. Great flavor. And other than that, we got a dog door, so the dogs kind of go out and in as they please. We got a bathroom, nothing special. And just laundry room with dog food, nothing special. We've also got the bedroom, of course. Uh, this is, uh, I do like my house a lot, but one of the things I don't like is that the rooms are pretty small. So for a master bedroom, it's kind of small. And uh, we've got some Star Trek stuff, because Star Trek is cool. Data, and Captain Jean-Luc Picard with a bathlet in the middle. Very lethal stuff. Also got, um, well, someone tried to escape once and uh, that's just uh, something to remember us. Zoom out, zoom out. And uh, yeah, a TV here as well that I fall asleep to watching Gorp stream. Yeah, that's the bedroom, so let's go to the more juicy stuff. He's tired. Here's an empty room, and uh, keep in mind I've lived here for about three years, so I don't know what to do with this room, so it's empty. It's a B223 or whatever they're called. Uh, very cool. We've got another bathroom, the door that leads to the dungeon. It's not in the blueprint, so I can't show it because it's legal. You're not allowed to create your own stuff, so I can't show that off. Uh, we also got a Room, another room here that I don't really use a lot. Uh, this is where we got the big ass, the big ass uh, Aces monitor, uh, which I'm sponsored with. And they, at first, they didn't want to give me this, but basically, I just cried a lot and whined, and eventually, they gave in and gave it to me. Thanks. Very cool. And uh, of course, the last room, the master room, where we spent a lot of time and play video games and stream. Uh, this is where I work. That's right, I W-O-R-K. And uh, I guess we can just start at uh, one side. I'm probably, I don't know what literally everything is. It's probably gonna be in the comment if you wanna know where to get and whatnot. Here's a big Nature's Prophet picture or painting that my mom made. One of a kind, so you cannot get that. And uh, Yakiro and Spear Breaker plushie. We also got a, uh, I think one of a kind, lone druid statue here that um, White Clouds made. They do have the template for it, so they might have made more, but I think it's the only one. And here's the real ages, of course. This is actually the real one, it's not a plastic one uh, that I won. I'm a one time TI winner. We also got uh, some monster in those, of course. Course. We also got a computer here, it's actually a debate, and it's something that will be given away eventually. Uh, the specs are decent, it's not a super high end PC, but I believe if I remember correctly, that will be given away. And we also got three monitors here from Asus, and uh, they are all curved. So before you, I had three monitors, and you needed some special stand to set it up like this, but when they're curved, they just, just look really good together. Very easy, we also got uh, Vengeful Spirit, uh, Silence of Doom, some other heroes, Illidan, you know, and here we got the Cool Roshan, here we got the Scuffed Roshan, Anti-Mage, some other things. And uh, yeah, we also got some light here because I'm a professional streamer. We also got a memory of Steve Irvin here that I've tried to look up at when I'm tilted to call myself and become a better person. It generally doesn't work, I still get tilted. And another camera here, I got a camera here that we use sometimes. Not always, but sometimes. And a soundboard, and here's the real Asus PC, since they sent me two one, and this is the, the 10K PC. It's not actually a 10K PC, but it's, you know, as good as they get. Uh, it's a custom one that they made, and it's very cool because it's got RGB on it, it lights up and stuff. It's very cool. 
very cool if you like that kind of things if you're 12. Uh, but R RGB is cool. Um, it's kind of just hiding here. Uh, I probably will go over specs in the comments if you want to know. It's already in the FAQ, I believe. Also, we got a streaming PC here. So we do have two PCs set up. It's not, honestly, if you're ever thinking about streaming, you definitely do not need two PCs, but it has very minor benefits, like, um, like slightly better quality, slightly better performance and whatnot. Uh, we also got a big ass air conditioner here. Is it called air conditioner? Whatever. Uh, air. It blows air, cold air, because it gets really hot sometimes. And when you have three PCs generating heat, a camera, two, three monitor, like everything generating heat, it gets fucking disgusting in here. So that thing kind of saves it. Uh, we also got a very manly axe here. I do kind of like to collect these things. I'm still looking for the large Roshan that was from a Chinese tournament. I've asked for it many times, but people just keep linking me the the small, tiny Roshan. I want the big Roshan. If anyone were to find that, I want it, and I want to buy it. Uh, also, we got some more paintings here. We got a uh, clock. It's made by my mom and Life Stealer. I'm not sure why she made Life Stealer. Uh, my Life Stealer is pretty pretty good though. Not gonna lie. So, but she made that one as well. This is something a fan made that I uh, I wanted. So I asked if I could get that and I could, so nice. And here's another one that mom made. A uh, old classic moment that you might remember. I'm not sure why it's holding the hex and uh, holding a uh, prophet head or whatever, but very cool nonetheless. And we also got uh, Vanguard here. And here we got kind of a, the Dota 2 table that White Clouds made. Uh, they still make them to this day, I believe. They're pretty expensive and they make them uh, how big as you want, pretty much, but they get real expensive if you want to make them super big. Uh, it's probably a little bit outdated because I've had it for uh, one or two years. So, nonetheless, it's very cool. Uh, but there might be some outdated stuff. Like that tower is not longer there, slightly moved. Thanks for the balance team, and I don't even remember this part in Dota. Was it ever like this, where you go down? Maybe it was. Very cool. And we also got the four Aegises that you get for buying Battle Pass. Thank you very much, Gaben. Very cool. I don't remember, is this 2015 or something like that? And of course, we've got the Ultra Rare collect Collectible. The 2013 Aegis Ring. That's right, you can't get this. Yeah, to get this, you need to win a TI. I'm also selling it if you want to have it uh, for um, $200,000. So if you really want it, just hit me up on Twitter. I might go down to $150,000 if you want it. I'm very proud of you. Um, we also got something, I think this is from Epicenter. This is a Russian thing, isn't it? I believe so. I have not figured out what heroes are. This is Bristle Tide. Timber, Clock, and I have no idea who this is. I thought Ogre, I, I, I don't know who this is. It might be a Kurt or something. I have no clue who that is. Also, we got some Dota 2 cards. Very rare. We got Roshan. We got Dendi. This is from uh, some Chinese tournament. I don't remember where it's from. Very cool things. Fada on Secret. Mind Control. Very cool, very cool, very cool. Also got a, a deck of cards with Dota things on it. Uh, very cool as well, very, very nice. And other than that, this is the uh, Mirana mount I talked about. You can get it yourself if you want. Here's the code. I've already used it though, so you can't use it, but here you go. And here's a wallet I got. I think it's a wallet. I don't know exactly what it is. I don't remember where it's from either. And also a fat punch. One of my most precious collectibles. A picture with Shiver that she took. Uh, I think she did this for all her subscribers at ESL. 2015. The good old days. Good old days. We also got, I think it's Bonnie and Pike out there. We got a little maiden. And a little trophy here I got from G1 when uh, back in 2013, I believe, where we stumped the Chinese. And another one here from WCA. 
And uh, sadly enough, and I don't have a trophy because uh, eventually we started doing rock, paper, scissors with Alliance about who gets a trophy. And if you won it, you couldn't do it again. So I think EGM got one, Loda and Aki got one. But then when it was only me and Espo left, we never won again. <laughs> so we didn't, uh, I never got a trophy. So, well, that's that. That is that. And that is the end of the house tour, I believe. I forgot to show you the most coolest thing as well. I forgot. This is the uh, award for eSport awards for best streamer, Nordic streamer. Wow. I won it. Haters, the best streamer right here, boys. Oh well, there you go. That's the end of the house tour. Hope you enjoyed it. Goodbye. This on. This on. Remember to click the subscription button, but that's not good enough. You gotta click the bell. Click the bell. You gotta also click the bell and thumbs up.